Hi viewers, welcome to Penhouse.in. In this video, we are going to see a short review on Starbun brand orange color body and silver color magnetic cap fountain pen. And here, this video is specifically taken to give you the clear insights on the pen because just with photos, you cannot fully understand about this. So here, this is an orange color body which has a, a magnetic silver color cap. And with this all stripes here there is a plain uh, surface which is not uh, which is a smooth finished plain surface in this portion you can engrave your names or uh, your logos in this pen and also this is a metal pen so you can complete a uh, engrave your names or anywhere on this pen and you can mention your names when, while you are ordering the pen itself on your order itself if you forgot there you can make a message or call us we are doing we will do that it is an on spot thing and let me take this and this is a number five nib which has a fine tip silver plated one and you can swap the nibs as you like since we have many uh, number 5.5 nibs in our site Usually pen enthusiast will swap with candid nibs where we have a fine, medium, broad and flex and again with gold, dual tone and silver plated nibs in this size. So you can swap as you wish and for that you can go to our site, click pen spares then go to nibs and there you can use a filter and make a query on what you require. And now the measurements of this pen. The holding area's diameter is 9.7 mm and the body is... 11.7 mm and the total length of this pen without cap is 114.9 mm and with cap it is 130.3 mm and yeah with this measurements you can get some idea for the pouches for this pen if you maintain this with the pouch and all the same aesthetic shininess will follow forever and now the entire weight of this pen is 30 grams and yeah the ink filling system here is a cartridge converter type you can use a cartridge for this pen and this is a converter you can pull this portion up and dip in the ink and push this back so ink will be filled up this portion this is the mechanism here and on pen maintenance please wash the pens regularly that is twice a month because all the dye based ink like our pen house ink or brill, sulika, daytone and all they will precipitate on the longer usage so it will block the ink's passage in the feeder so it will get a scratchy writing and slowly the ink will dry quickly and then you may have to shake the pens for the ink flow to come out This you might have experienced and the reason is the blockage in the feeder screw. So to remove the dust and deposits in the feeder, you can hold this portion together and remove the feeder from a feeder unit from the grip portion and flush the feeder with the help of a toothbrush or any brush and clean it well with the soap, soap water and or in running tap water. If you are soaking in soap water then allow it for an hour and brush and clean. And in some ink bottles itself, you can notice on every fill it is recommended to clean the pen. In brill bottle, it is given. Clean your pen with water before filling with brill ink. It is unique formulation, prevents clogging and aids quick drying on paper. So it is clear. Unless otherwise we have a good cleaning and maintenance, the flow will be affected. And also few nibs need to be fine tuned. Because during the manual assembly of nibs, the tines may stick together. So gently push the tines up and down so it will create some space in between the tines so you will get a uh, smooth writing and a very good ink flow. And in the feeder it is mentioned as 8. And now some writing sample of this pen. For that I am using our penhouse emerald green ink.
Yeah, very good writing. It is a medium writing, but in the nib portion, it is given as a platinum tipped fine. But it is in, uh, given in the nib portion, and it is not the, that much fine writing. So yeah, it is upon your wish. And yeah, if you have any query about this pen, you can ask in the comment section or else you can make a call to the mobile number. Thanks for watching this video. Thank you.